leaders and things that God is doing in their life. I don't know if you know or not. Uh, you were not here last week. We kind of announced that they would be taking over. Uh, Rise and Star. Let's give a lot of hand of praise for that. So awesome. Uh, Rob has had an opportunity to uh, lead some of the uh, bowl uh, lessons and uh, did an awesome job. Uh, during the fast, he's been sending out text messages to all the men. And it's just been an awesome thing. And I know Lane, she was dancing during the conference, just showing out. <laughs> you want to give us a move or something like that? Come on. No? Okay, I'm going to mess with you. All right. But anyway, they're excited about the Lord. And it's our responsibility as a church to continue to train everyone up uh, in the ways of God. And, and so I just believe that it's awesome. But a few months ago, I don't know if you remember it or not, I said, listen. Uh, mark this day. If you give a seed today, a year from now, if you say, PJ, I gave ten dollars, I gave sixty dollars, I gave one hundred twenty dollars, I gave a thousand dollars, and I never saw the fruit from it, I said, come back, let me know, and we will give you your money back. How many of you guys are here that Sunday when I said that? Woo! Amen. All right. So they came up either to say God bless or give me my money back. <laughs> 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 But anyway, give them a hand. They got a testimony that they want to give, and we just want to encourage them in the Lord. How about you? A couple of months ago, uh, September, to be exact, um, yeah, during um, times in offering, you know, um, God did, um, he laid uh, a number in my heart, you know, and, you know, I kind of like wrestled with him, you know, because like, the number he put in was pretty much like everything in our checking, you know, like, you know, when we, we do give, you know, uh, you know, as often as much as we can. But um, just that number you put in my heart, I like wrestled with. But I shared it with Chelaine, and you know, that that number that he gave me, he also put in her heart. So, awesome. like, of course, you know, we want to be obedient, and we want to, you know, um, receive blessing from the Lord, you know. And so we did uh, give that um, exact number, you know, and. Just knowing, you know, the, God's promise, you know, in um, uh, Malachi three ten, you know, um, you know, where it says, um, bring the whole tithe to the storeroom, yep. and um, you know that He will uh, give it back, you know, with uh, with more. Yes. And um, just uh, <laughs> so yeah, God did exactly that. It was funny because that very same night.
Mindy. <laughs> Come on, give a lot of hands. Folks, like, really, 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 really shy. But let me tell you, the, the day that they received that check, they texted me, Pastor Sam, and, and a few others. And uh, I, I, I guess, can I tell them how much the Lord has blessed you? Or do you just kind of keep it low, right? Uh, okay, I won't share it then. It was $2,000. Give the Lord a hand of praise for that. That's so awesome. Some would say, listen, some would say, well, you know, that's happenstance. There is nothing happenstance when it comes to God, right? I am reminded of the widow's wife. The Bible says that she cast in a basket all she had, amen, and God took note of that. And so I didn't ask Robin Lane to come up to kind of talk about just giving, but it's about the heart in which we give. Because when we give from a grateful heart, understand everything that we have belongs to God. When we sow that seed, God gives it back. He doesn't relent. He doesn't hold on it. So